soon as Michael told me that he was being disciplined, I said to him, we need to let our Unite members know that you're being disciplined. And as soon as we told them, they immediately as well felt the same. There was no question. Management had jumped to find an excuse to discipline Michael.
so many members and schools in Newham. You have got a support base there, Michael, that, to be honest, is the easiest campaign I've ever had to run in Newham. Because every, <laughs> everybody is there already because they know you and what you do. And obviously the, the kind of craziness of the, of the situation, the allegations, obviously adds to that. But regardless, people have got your back because you always have theirs. And solidarity from Lewisham because the committee support you, I support you, and I know our members support you. Solidarity, Michael. I have just come from United Voices of the World office down in Bethel Green, Whitechapel, to offer our solidarity greetings to Unite members out on strike. Michael is great. He is a kind person. He works for the member to the best of his ability, and he shouldn't have been treated this way. And we are going to support him to the end. I just want to say very briefly a huge thanks to everyone who's here today. Your solidarity and support is really fantastic. I don't deserve all this support, but I'm, I'm, I'm so grateful for all of it. I'm not perfect. I've made lots of mistakes over many, many years. Sure, I'm open about that. But on this case, I make no mistake. This was a member who fully deserved the support of our union, and we don't support low-paid black female members. What are we here for? What's the point of our union? So I have no regrets about that whatsoever. I'm sure I did the right thing. And I'm really pleased we got to a good settlement in the end. Now, the union wants to discipline me for that, but I think you've all gathered it's a much bigger story than that. Because we all know, we've all seen lots of schools and lots of employers where they operate heavy-handed, hierarchical management. Well, those things are wrong in schools, but comrades, they should have no place in our union whatsoever. A lot of our colleagues in London region have come out solidarity with Michael and they continue to come out today and yesterday we agreed as a group that we are going to take three more days of strike action and we will continue to support our rep because today it could be Michael Gavin tomorrow it could be me but it also could be any of us who work for the National Education Union because if this is the way that they treat one of us, they could treat any one of us like that too. So I feel hopeful after the last two days because I'm surrounded by wonderful, wonderful people and this is why I chose to work for the National Education Union and that hasn't changed and I will carry on working for the National Education Union and try and change the things that are wrong with it. So thank you for joining me today. We have also put together a petition, sign it and share it with everyone you know. We want as many people from the public to sign it. This is a picket line of organisers, so I really expect them to really show their very best today. Off you go. <laughs> Yeah.